there. This is Barbara Dom speaking, and today I want to talk to you about overcoming stuttering. There are a lot of different ideas out there about what is possible. Can people who stutter overcome their stuttering, or is it best to accept it? Well, I understand why a lot of people who stutter think that it is best to accept it and learn to live a good quality life with stuttering. That's really one perspective. But there's another perspective, and that is that people who stutter can speak naturally. Now, I have uh, seen why so many people believe that that isn't true, and I think it's because they've been going down the wrong pathway. They've been using techniques that sometimes are harder to do than to stutter. And they don't even really help all of the time. So there's a whole lot of ideas out there about stuttering that I think would not be there if we looked at it in a different perspective. People who stutter can speak with normal fluency and in, in a natural way. I don't mean controlled fluency, I mean natural fluency. So what I've done is I've developed a webinar that I am going to be giving and I will have the link below so that you can click on it and you can join in. And in this webinar, I'm going to be telling you about seven powerful ways to overcome stuttering. Now, this isn't a magic cure. I don't believe that there is any, well, I don't believe stuttering is a sickness, so I don't think there's a cure for it. But it's not that I have some magic technique to give you, but there are powerful things that you can do if you're a person who stutters. And you know what? When you do these things, your natural fluency emerges. So click on the link, register for this webinar, and I hope to see you there because I think it's really going to be an exciting and informative time for all of us. Bye.